everyone and welcome to another TDR family gaming video. This is Droid TDR and today what are we doing? What are we doing in Liyue? What are we doing in Liyue, Traveler? OMG. We just had two absolutely stunningly amazing made this game and the grinding thus far all worthwhile episodes. Battle for Childy Ch with Childy Child for the Zuvier Gnosis for Rex Lapis, with which was really just a scam to get him out in the open and reveal his plan. But unfortunately, his plan pulled a sea monster god thing from the water, and we had to sacrifice the Flying Palace in order to save Liyue with all the Adepti's help and all of the... Uh, um, whatever they are, are Archons? I, Adepti? I don't know. Anyways. The Chi-Sing and the Adepti helped out. So, big breath. <sighs> now I have to go figure out where the heck's his Rex Lapis, because apparently he ain't dead. It was all a big sham. Could have told you that. But, uh, Lisa, you need to wake up, buddy. What is going on with you? We're done with the Golden House of Pancakes, so let's get you some pancakes. There we go. Oh my gosh, you barely still have any health. Both you and Diona, what? You guys barely survived those battles now. All right, let's get you guys some food here. Um, have some, uh, you know, delicious grilled tiger fish because who doesn't want that? Here we go. You can have two of those, that'd probably do you good. And Diona, you can have one, you can heal. Benny, do you really need tiger fish? You do, don't you? All right, we'll give you some tiger fish too. Holy. Good golly, we still need lots and lots of food. Unbelievable. But right now, we gotta figure out where is Zhang Li, because he was suspiciously absent from this whole bit of madness. And I have a suspicion that he is actually Rex Lapis. But we shall see. Let's go, wait, teleport there. Yeah, we don't wanna run up all the docks. It just takes too long, takes too long, takes too long. So, let's go follow the sparkle trail with the happy music and everybody now saying, yay, the Fatui are done, child's plan was foiled. Where is Zhongli? Hey, what's up, fairy lady? What's up with you? Is there anything I can do for you too? Yes. I'm afraid that Wangsheng Funeral Parlor isn't in the best state to receive guests. How come? We've come to see Zhang Li. Could you please tell him we're here? Unfortunately, Zhang Li isn't here at the moment. Hmm. It seems he went to Northland Bank. Well, why Does would he do the that? Northland Bank belong to the Fatui? Last oh. time we saw Zhang Li was before we went to the Golden House. Maybe he went to raid. Do you think he doesn't know about bank. the Bank? Well, the, the Fatui, Fatui were trying to raid the Golden House. More trouble. Ah. We had better go and make sure that everything is okay. Hmm. Strange things are afoot now in Liyue. Look for Zhang Li at the Northern Bank. And where, pray tell, is that? It's this way, Sparkle Path. It's this way. Fantastic. And we have to go exactly along the path. If we deviate... Oh, it's a bad thing. Come on, Sparkles. Show me the way. Show me the way. Oh, no. I didn't turn fast enough. All right. It's almost here. Almost here. Oh, no. I lost Sparkle. I lost Sparkle. Can I get Sparkle back? No. Hey, Nadia. What do you have to say? Anything? Guard. Oh, good evening. This is the Northland Bank. Uh... Are you still thinking about your brother? What I should write in this letter? Usually I write my family back home, but I begin... But recently I've gained a pen pal. Tell me about your pen pal. Well, he's a guard here at the Northland Bank, but he's on duty during the day. Well, I'm on duty at night, to tell you the truth. I accidentally left a letter I'd written for my brother, and then perhaps the other guard must have got a letter for him. He even wrote me a reply. I could be between the lines to tell that he was probably very lonely, so I thought it would be good to go along. And eventually writing him became part of my life. I've even started looking forward to receiving his letters. Hee hee hee. Oh, something's brewing there. 
Something going on. Wait, what? No, I went in the bank. No, stop. Stop, stop. Clicky, clicky. Goodbye. Take care now. Enter bank. There we go. I wonder if there's going to be another epic battle as well. You call this cooperation between Harbingers? Huh. Cooperation involves communication, you know. <laughs> Don't take it to heart, child. Besides, oh. aren't you happy that you got to skip the formalities and bring chaos to the land? Wait, what? I'm sure you must have enjoyed that. Oh, it seems that some of your friends have arrived. Oh, dear me. Hey, it's Zhang Li and child. Zhang Li? You, you're also one of the Harbingers? Uh-oh, Senora <laughs> It's you two. I believe we've met once before. In the city of Bards, was it? Hmm. I'm glad you still remember my name. Ah, right. I imagine that it must have been rather hard to forget watching helplessly as something precious was snatched away from your friend. Breathe, just stay calm. I still have time to take it back. No, don't let her get to you. You okay. failed to gather the powers of all seven elements. It's true. And our last battle at the Golden House was almost more than you could handle. Not really. I could have. So I, I took him pretty to good. Peaceful this time, seeing that two of the Harbingers are here. Oh yeah, that's just well, true. If it isn't you two, this is our first time seeing each other since Liyue was nearly wiped off the map. Hmm. This is certainly a bit awkward, wouldn't you say? A little. <laughs> Paimon knew that we should never have trusted a Fatui Harbinger. Fatui! Oh, now don't say that. Sure, I may have misled you, but I never had anything against you personally. Well... Besides, <laughs> I thought we were getting along quite well together, didn't you? Except for that little tussle we had at the end. <laughs> yeah, where well, we beat Nothing you, buddy. Personal. We just have different views, that's all. Of course, you may very well hold this against me, but that's up to you. And and it is the up to me. The real deceivers here are Senora and Zhang Li. Curse them for leading me on. Wait, Senora and Zhang Li? What? So actually, I think. Stop wasting time, child. There'll be plenty of time to chat once I'm through here. You remember the agreement, Morax? Uh, I now, knew it. If you would be so kind. The Gnosis, please. No, he is. He is Morax, the Lorax, the Rex Lapis. Oh, and he's going to just give her the Gnosis? What? What in the world are you talking about? We saved you. Why the would you agree to that? is fulfilled. That which thou seeketh is now bestowed unto thee. What? For Don't do promise. it. He's solid as stone. Don't do it, dude. Why? Why would he do that? Why? Oh, sanctimonious. Zhejin Li is actually... I, we, we knew that. We knew that. We knew that. But what? still, so why are you doing it? Chia? Why? No, wait. That's an exciting twist and all, but why give the Gnosis to the Fatui? Seriously, dude. I do not give it for free. I give it as agreed upon in the contract. For it is a matter solely between the Tsaritsa and I. Really? Um... I don't really understand why yeah, you would do that. You don't think you went a little bit too far with that whole fake death thing? Everyone was preparing the ceremony for you and splat! This big dragon falls out of the sky and all of Lyric goes into an uproar! Talk about a disaster. Serious. <laughs> Gathering all the forces that had been bubbling behind the scenes, and then stirring them together in a pot that was bound to boil over. That's what he wanted to see, am I right? Hmm. Wait, what? Perhaps it's best that I explain. Please do, sir. As you know, I've dwelt upon this world for more than 6,000 years. It is now 3,700 years ago that I founded Liyue together with the Adepti. Okay. Even boulders that can withstand whirlpools will erode with the passing of time. I kept convincing myself that cracks had not begun to form, and that the end of my time had not yet come. 
until okay. one drizzly day, as I was strolling along the harbor, I heard a merchant tell one of his workers, You finished your duties. Go ahead and call it a day. Okay. I stood motionless among the crowds, asking myself, Have I already finished my duties? Dude. But as I began to consider relinquishing my divine role, I soon discovered that many reasons still remained to not hastily depart. Indeed. Was Liyue, the city I had dwelt in for so long, already prepared to enter its next age? I decided that a test was needed in order to reveal the answer. Okay. So I feigned my own death and gathered the cast of Child, the Adepti, and the Liu Chising to play their roles together on the stage that was Liu. Oh my gosh. So are you satisfied with the finale? Let me guess, you had another plan in case it all burned down. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. That's right. Which is why I continued to safeguard the Gnosis until now. So you mean that if the chaos ever reached the point of no return, you would simply appear and use your divine powers to bring Liu back under control? Of course, and it would have been all too easy for him too. Oh, Just as a child but we made it not after happen. After losing their parents, so has Liu matured when faced with the death of its deity. Oh dear. In the end, the resolution to all that has transpired was even more satisfactory than I could have hoped for. Oh dear. Take the Adepti, for instance. Owing to their years of seclusion, they were the least informed. Yet when faced with a crisis. They commendably showed the greatest amount of restraint possible. Not only did they manage to cooperate with the Chising, but in the end, they even made efforts to understand the hearts of the people. Hmm. Credit is also due to Signora, the emissary dispatched by the Cryo Archon to fulfill our contract. At my request, she kept everything she knew in strict confidence. This despite the eavesdropping ears of her colleague, Child. Hmm. This meant I could remain as Zhongli, even having the chance to fulfill the age-old traditions of Liu in this mortal form. Thank you for joining me on this journey, traveler. Dude, you just wanted to see if it was okay to believe? There is only one thing that I had not anticipated, and that was the conduct of the Liu Qixing. I had expected them to do no more than the Adepti, to come to the defense of Liu. But when all was said and done, they seized the opportunity to supplant Liu as divine protectors and used the subsequent power vacuum left by my death to quickly gain complete control of Liu. Okay. That doesn't sound good at all. Ha. <laughs> On the contrary. Hmm. I think it is excellent. I had always feared that it was too soon for them to take over from me. And it was also that which I longed for the most. As such, this is the best parting gift anyone could have given this god of old. Really? Hey, why are you leaving? Me? Doesn't anyone feel the least bit of remorse for deceiving me? You've practically kept me in the dark. That's all for the better, <laughs> shieldy I think child. That thanks would be more appropriate. You certainly played no small part in all of this, wreaking havoc and turning the city upside down. The Lord of Geo ought to thank you for your performance, if anything. Hmm. If you hadn't created the pressure of a battle between mortals, Adepti, and a god, the lump of coal resting in the hands of the Geo Archon, Liu would never have been able to become a dazzling diamond of a city. Huh? Just whose side are you what? on mocking me like that? Are you itching oh, for a fight? Man. You were both equally Be fooled, that dude. As it may. You've come out of this as the hero of Liu. I, on the other hand, will be forever prescribed as a disturber of the peace, no? Uh, pretty true. <laughs> well then, with the Gnosis in my possession, I have no use for such idle chatter. We should return to Zapolyarni Palace and seek an audience with Her Majesty, the Saritza. Come, child. Ah, fine. Uh. I'll meet you there later. I'm not sharing a boat with the likes of you. <laughs> Do as you wish. My goodness. What a now then, jerk. 
Is there anything she else is. you wish to ask me? Yeah, I'd like you to know what the Cryo Archon offered you, or what could possibly be worth the Gnosis. The same thing, same question. Okay. Right. As Zhang Li always told us, a good trade is a fair trade. Paimon has no idea what could be a good trade for a Gnosis. Right. Realistically speaking, there is no such thing. Huh? So why'd you do However, it? However, I am the god of contracts. For thousands of years, I have made countless contracts. If the deal was of no benefit, then I certainly would not be inclined to agree to it. Of course. My agreement with the Cryo Archon will be the last of my contracts as the Geo Archon. My contract to end all contracts. Okay, fine. Your as final for the act. bargaining chip that the Tsaritsa used to balance the scales. Yeah. You cover that answer for yourself in your future journeys. Oh, really? So you're not even going to tell us what you got. Unbelievable. Unbelievable, Zhongli. Unbelievable. How? How could you? I'm mad. I'm mad. I'm mad. Why would you ditch your responsibilities? Windblade, Windblade to you, sir. Windblade and Chop Chop. And Ha Ha Chua. I, I'm the, uh, blown away there. I am blown away. What is with you, dude? can't absorb so much information at once. So, Zhang Li, what sort of contract yes. is this time with tell the Yes, tell us, tell us. One of the clauses of our contract was not to divulge any of its oh, contents. Oh, come on, dude. Uh, Gag so order. Petty. Seriously. Uh, Still mad at you, dude. Ha. ha! Still mad. Wait, can we steal any of the money up here? Can we get on in here behind the behind the deck? No? No? This is the Fatui Bank, isn't it? Anything? Any books, maybe? Any books to take away and complete collections? Oh! Hello there, precious chest. It's just Mora, though. I want more of that, but um, bump But that's sad. It's just Mora. Unbelievable. Is there? Wait. Oh, maybe I can climb other places in here. Little bank bank heist going on. No, it can't get up there. Can I climb up over here? No. Can I climb the walls? No. I can't do it. Can I glide over somewhere else? Ah, climb up this wall. Nope, can't do it. Shucks. All right, well, hey, there was at least one chest that we could get to. So, so take that, Fatui Bank. Take that. Unbelievable. After the dust settles, I couldn't even read that. Today's it went so fast. Is the of All right, Although well, let's do the right of parting. We spent so much time trying to organize it. It would be a real shame not to go there now. It sure would be a real shame. In fact, you know what else would be a shame? Not to collect the thing that says, "Hey, you logged in today. Way to go." Nice. Ah. <sighs> Still, wait, or do we, we must have some achievements for everything we've done. We should collect those. Wonders of the world. Quick as lightning. Da -da. And Lily loves music. I don't know what that was. Defeat child. Childy child. Derail. Defeat the overlord of the vortex. Child. Ba -doom, boom, boom. Nice. Art of the adventure. Grasp how 20 different dishes are made. Apparently, now I know how that is done. Anything else down here we should uh, mind ourselves with? No, 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 no. Okay, fine. Great, great. And oh, do we have mail? We have mail. You've got mail. Claim it all. I got more realm currency that we don't know what to do with. Nice. How fantastic. Well, good golly gosh. That was not expected. Not expected at all. Somewhat frustrated and upset about the whole bank ordeal. 
but it is what it is. Upset that Zhongli is, seems to be throwing in the towel, but maybe it's all subterfuge. Maybe he's got another plan, another plot to do something else, and he needed to free himself from his commitment to Liu A in order to go and do this something else. I don't know. That's what I'm hoping for. All right. Well, anyways, whoa, lights went on. Thank you all for watching. We will see you in the next one where we finally wrap up the rite of parting. Goodbye.